Hello everyone. Good afternoon. So welcome to today's session. In today's session, we'll be dealing with mainly grade eight, and I'll be telling you what is the score all about and uh, how it is related to your scholarship test. Right? We'll see in detail. So a score is basically Sri Chaitanya scholarship test, and a score itself stands for Sri Chaitanya Outstanding Achiever Reward Examination. Right? where there is 350 crores scholarship and 2.5 CR cash rewards also in form of various gadgets you can get and various other things. Hi Rehan, how are you? I hope everyone is good and we are good to go. Right? So today's session is focused on grade 8 mainly. So I'll be telling you what is syllabus, what is exam pattern, in grade 8 and this score series it is basically divided in three parts so in first part what we are doing we are providing strategy videos for this exam and second part is this exam itself which will be conducted on two days that is 28 September and 12th of October right so these two days you can give and it's very flexible you can give online also you can give offline also so registrations have started also Rehan, you have applied, very good. So today's session is basically an introduction session only. From next session onwards, we'll be dealing with particular subjects because in this test, there will be uh, physics, chemistry, bio, IQ. One subject is there which will be related to testing your reasoning ability and maths. So major focus will be on maths and reasoning ability, that is IQ. For class 12th, you have applied. Okay, this scholarship test is from grade 3rd to 12th, mainly focused from 5th to 10th, right? So let's see one by one. So here, if you go on shrichaitanyascore.com, this is the mail, uh, that link for coming to this page, right? Here you can see what is score. So you will definitely be getting a scholarship and you can even get, get up to 100% for getting into admission at Sri Chaitanya Academy or other online platforms like Infinity Learn, right? As I told you, this exam will be conducted in off, online and offline format and result will be declared in November 2025. And you will be getting updates through WhatsApp. So these are the exciting rewards, cash reward. You can even win a trip to NASA, right? 100% scholarship is also applicable for deserving candidates. You can stand a chance to win exciting gadgets too. After this, how to register? Like, so here you will find a button, right? Register now. If you click on this, you have to fill in your details, exam date and time, pay the uh, test registration fee and don't worry it is very uh, nominal right after that you can attempt your test on the date whether it's on 28 September or 12th of October here you will find syllabus and pattern for all the grades as today we are mainly focusing on grade 8 so I'll select 8 and now I can see all the details. 90 questions will be there. 30 questions from math, 30 questions from IQ, 10 questions from physics, 10 questions from chemistry, and 10 questions from bio. These questions will not be direct questions, right? I'm telling you right now only. I'll also show you a mock. So these questions will be conceptual, right? From easy to moderate level. It will be, I'll show you. All questions, all 90 questions will be MCQ type. There is plus three marks for correct answer and minus one for negative answer. So in total, it will be 90 into three, 270 marks test. And duration will be 120 minutes, right? So you have to do time management also. You have to complete this in 120 minutes. Slabus, I'll show you. So it will include class seven slabus plus two months of class 8 slavers also. So easily you can tackle it. Now here you can see 
as I'll be taking a math session, so in maths, you will be having few chapters from grade seven, like data handling, symmetry, perimeter and area and visualizing solid shapes. So first we will start with rational numbers. So in this series, we will be providing maths, science videos also to help you to tackle this uh, score exam, right? In physics, you will get force and pressure, friction, sound, chemical effect, work power energy and motion and time from seventh grade only. So easily you can do, light chapter is there. In chemistry, you will get two chapters, acid, bases and salt, physics, physical and chemical changes, these two from 7. In this IQ, you will get questions which will test your reasoning ability, right? Or I can say your tactics and strategies in decision making. So these things will be tested and I'll show you questions also as I said. In bio, you can see there are two chapters from 7th reproduction in plants and transportation in living beings, right? Okay, now here if you come, you can click for free mock test. So how will you divide this 120 minutes to attempt this uh, 90 question test, right? So I would suggest you to give because there is 30 question in IQ and 30 question in maths. But those 30 question in math, it will need approx 50, 55 minutes, right? It will take certain time. After that, suppose you are taking 50 minutes for maths, you have to do IQ question, those are also 30. So you can do it for uh, 40, 40 minutes, so 50 and plus 40 that is 90. In 30 minutes, you can do physics, chemistry and bio because in chemistry and bio, especially in bio, you will be getting a statement type of questions which if you know, you can solve and if you don't know, then you have to skip it, right? Because in maths, you will be solving questions and it will take time, right? It may take one to two minutes. For easy question, it, it may take even less than one minute. So this is the case. If I show you mock test, so in this, you will get In instructions are given. First, we'll start with IQ. It will have 30 questions. Each question will have four options in actual test also, and only one is correct. Plus three will be for the full marks if you have done it correct, and minus one for the uh, questions which you got incorrect. So if you see the type of questions, this is based on uh, inequality, right? The first one, as I said, IQ and maths will take time. So you have to make sure that you are doing it in a efficient manner. You can see the type of questions complete the given letter analogy, LTF, Q, I, W, Y, G, S, D, V, G. It is related to this. So how this D, O, I, Y, K, V is related to out of these four options. So I'll give you a brief idea how to do these type of questions. To do these analogy questions, you should know there are 26 letters in uh, 26 letters in English, right? So you should know the numbering because then only you can decode the pattern. Like L is at 12th position, W is at 23 position, V is at 22. J is at 10, D is at 4, O is at 15th position. So if you write those numbers, write this, and in below you will write Y, G, S, D, V, G, then you will be able to decode it, right? So these things are must, then only you can solve. Now we'll see maths. What type of questions are there in maths? So maths will also have uh, 30 questions. Each question will carry three marks for the correct. First question is 11 raised to power x equal to 3 raised to power y equal to 99 raised to power z. 
how will you find 1 upon x plus 1 upon y plus 1 upon z? Those who are present, can you solve this? Can you solve this particular question? So how to solve this? I'll tell you in upcoming sessions, right? It's very easy based on, you can say, law of exponent we can do. There is a certain pattern which needs to be followed in that. So today we are not dealing with questions. Today I am telling you what is score all about and why you should give. Because it will bridge the gap right now if you are having right you will get expert guidance also to ace in your school exam as well as your uh, upcoming future competitions right so it's very beneficial for you so do make sure that you are uh, filling the registration right and your test can be on 28 september and 12th of october test date and time it will be allotted on the basis of your grade and your test location you can give this test from home also. As I said, it's very fl flexible. And if you want to give it offline, you can give it from any Sri Chaitanya offline center also, right? It will be also held in schools. So, so be a part of this uh, India's largest scholarship test. And we'll again meet in the upcoming sessions of score series where I'll be discussing maths, right? So I'll be telling you strategies which you need to follow in maths particularly, right? And other faculties will guide you with science subjects. Got it everyone? So that's all for today's session. Meet you in the upcoming session. Bye-bye.